What's up all you docs? This is the Lego Boss coming at you guys with another Lego review. Today we're opening Lego minifigures Looney Tunes. This is set number 71030. It's recommended for ages 5 and up and it has 8 pieces per bag. Retails for $4.99 US dollars per bag and each bag comes with one minifigure. I've been planning on reviewing Lego Looney Tunes for quite some time, but it's a good thing I, re I decided to review them today because it is the release of Space Jam 2, which is very exciting. Now, without any further ado, let's open these up and see who we get. Got my knife. Let's open the first pack. Hope I don't hit anything. And it is... Oh! Hey, it's Marvin the Martian. Nice. So our first minifigure we opened up is Marvin the Martian. Now, he's the only LEGO Looney Tunes figure in this series to have a traditional minifigure head. Because as you can see, after looking at this checklist, he, the other minifigures in the series have new molded heads. So, anyway, looking at this figure, the only printing on his face is these big ol' eyes and on this black head, and his helmet mixes this green knight-looking helmet with a broom on top. He's even got a green skirt, which uses a cloth piece, and the only thing that has printing on him is his little red mid-legs, which have printing of his shoes. And his accessory is a little blaster in lime green. All right, next pack. Oh, what do you know? It's Bugs Bunny. Eh, watch out, Doc. So here is Bugs Bunny himself, and he's got this massive new molded head with those big old ears, and he's even got a wacky expression printed on his face. And as for his torso, he's got a little print of his underbelly, and he's also got a print of his two feet. And on the back, he's also uh, got a back printing of his tail. And his accessory is a little build for a carrot, of course. Now on to our third pack. And it is... Oh. Oh. Oh, it's Speedy Gonzalez. So here is Speedy Gonzalez and... There is a lot going on with him. As you can see, he's got this standard new molded head that is also dual molded with his massive sombrero. And he's also got a printed uh, bow or tie, uh, whatever that is in red. And on the back, he's got a new waist piece that has this little uh, tail made of rubber. And he's also got dual molded mini legs, which also have some printing of his toes. And his accessory is four slices of cheese, which is one too many. We're halfway there, everyone. And it is... Oh, is that... Oh wait, it's uh, Petunia the Pig. So our fourth minifigure is Petunia the Pig. Now, I'm kind of unfamiliar with this character, but anyway, she has this new molded head that has hair popping out each with red bows on the side of her ponytails. And she's even got a printed uh, neck collar on her torso with uh, dual molded arms. See, she's even got a red skirt and underneath, you've got some printed uh, pants and hooves on her mid legs. And her accessories are a teacup and a teapot. Time for our fifth pack. And it is, oh, it's a second Speedy Gonzalez. So here's our second Speedy Gonzalez, and I don't know what else to say. Hopefully I can find some uses for him. All right, time to go to our last bag. Let's hope we don't get a duplicate. And it is, ooh. It's Porky the Pig. What better way to end this video with Porky the Pig? 
Now as you can see, he's got the same molded head as Petunia Pig, but without the hair. And he's also got a nice torso printing of his little blue vest and a bow tie in red. And he's even got some mid-leg printing of his uh, hooves. And if you go to the back, he's got a little uh, printing of his uh, little tail. And his accessory, of course, is a little build for a sign that says, that's all folks, because we're at the end of the video. So overall, what do I think of this minifigure series in general? Well, like me, if you love Looney Tunes, this is the kind of minifigure series just for you. Because there's a lot of cool exclusive figures, especially ones with unique molded heads and pieces. And it's a kind of a series that you would want in your collection. And it's so sad to me that I got a duplicate, but at least there'll be another blind bag opening for another video. But overall, this is a cool minifigure series, and I would definitely recommend to those who love Looney Tunes to, to check out this series. So what are your guys' thoughts on this series? Please leave a comment down below. Also, be sure to like and subscribe to the LEGO Boss, and I'll see you all in another LEGO review. Bye-bye, folks.